Kathleen. And I'm Gil from the Rich Relationship Podcast. And this is our segment on the big road trip with Gil and Renee. Tripping with Gil and Renee. The best gas station in the world, Bucky. Hey, hey guys, you know it's me, Renee, and our whole goal for this year is PEP, People, Places, Experience. We are in San Marcos, Texas, and we had to stop at our favorite restaurant. It is called Earth Burger. They have the best vegan and gluten-free burgers we've ever had. So we just wanted to let you guys see the place and check it out. They are COVID compliant, so if you guys are in the area and you're looking for a delicious place to go and have plant-based vegan options, check out da, 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 Earth Burger! Yay! It's only in Texas though, so you gotta check it out. Bye-bye! Enjoying a beautiful sunset walk in sunny San Antonio. Okay, we are at the Chalet Hoskins having an amazing time working from outside, enjoying the beautiful view. Okay, we are having a salad bar today for lunch. Stay tuned. Salad bar and french fries. Yay! In the air fryer. Okay. This is, this is B. When your brother is the juice man. That's B. He's telling you what his <laughs> recipe <laughs> is. He got the green That's juice the and we got the red cheese. juice. And he got his formers written down in his special recipes. Beets, that he don't. Carrots, orange, celery, cucumber, apple, spinach, kale. Mm. And then this is uh, beets, mm. pineapple, orange. Yummy, yummy. We got the juice. We are at the Hoskins having the juicy juice. Oh, that's, that's Guys, man, this has been such an amazing time. We are here at Redeeming Grace Church in San Antonio, and they have this amazing garden. I am just in awe. Look at this. They are providing greens and produce for people in the neighborhood to get them involved and get them to learn how to grow their own food. They have cauliflower, they have cabbage. I wanna say those are turnips. It's absolutely remarkable. So beautiful to see people using their gifts and talents to teach people how to eat real food. The name of the church is called Redeeming Grace. I'm going to walk around some more and let you guys see. Got some turnip greens over there growing. Got all kinds of goodies. And this gentleman is growing these things himself. And he wants the neighborhood to get involved. So if you guys live in this area, please get involved. Bring your kids out. Okay, yeah, COVID is going on. But this is something that you can do 
that is COVID compliant come out and get some of his beautiful, beautiful, look at this kale, y'all. Absolutely beautiful. That's the dinosaur kale. Got some purple. I want to say that's kale too. Purple kale. Well, I just want you all to see this. I want to take you on and let you see. These are the kind of things that we just really love to do because we want you to eat more real, whole, plant-based foods. And so if you live in San Antonio, come over here and check this out. Bring your kids so that they can learn about agriculture and how to make food grow, but absolutely beautiful. He has such a variety. He even has Napa cabbage, y'all. He has it all. And I had... I mean, I don't think... Renee I'm... is actually picking kale out here in the beautiful garden look at that and it's going to taste even better as juice and in the salad yay normally at a certain time you know they bolt up a seed out to do seeds for the next generation well that what happened is they did that except one plant it just kept growing and so it went for about four years you know and then it bolted or uh, went to seed or flowered it out. So what I did, I uh, collected the seeds and the next year I planted a lot, a lot of them you know, at home. And that, you know, went. And so the third year, the, the insects got a hold to them, you know, and just destroyed them so I didn't get any seeds. So that was my first introduction to tall. They, they grew eight feet tall. I don't have any seeds, but I have pictures at home of them, you know, because I could stand underneath them, you know. And people used to come, and uh, they were amazed because they took pictures and they're standing on them, and they're probably all over the country, so somebody else. You know, in order to change, you got to do something different. Yep. And this church in San Antonio, they're doing it. Agape Christian Center. Eggplant pizza. 